if you do want to be in with a chance to win those two hammocks, we're just putting mum's hammock away. I'm not happy. Look, look. I'm not happy. Saying, hello, welcome back and welcome to the summer. As you can see from the title of the video, I'm taking my mother wild camping <laughs> for her first wild camp. Can you believe this? I must be mad. So, not only is it a first wild camp, it's actually a birthday tomorrow. So, and anyone, we're not on our own, cameraman stands here. So yeah, stick around and then uh, catch up in a bit. So if you're not already, if you haven't already done so, I'm going to give me mother a follow on there uh, on YouTube. She uploaded her first video last week and got over 900 subscribers. So let's see if we can, we can get to a thousand before she can get to a thousand. So do me a favor, just click on that old subscribe button. You're for it now. Cheers. My mother's even bought the plates. <laughs> I'm not sure if I mentioned it or not, but it's a birthday tomorrow. Yeah, cheers, Prosecco. In the woods. Lovely tea. Nice evening. Thank you, Rob. She's got so a Prosecco. Far, so far, so good, actually. I'm quite enjoying it. I don't know about later on. <laughs> She's happy so far, yeah. She's worried about the snakes and stuff. <laughs> I am. Anyway, I'm going to scoss some of this down. We've got a beer. Cheers. So uh, if you've been following, following me for a while, you'll know that I said I was going to give away a hammock at 500 subscribers. And then a company reached out and said, we're going to give you one as well to give away as well. So I've got two hammocks to give away. I'm just going to do one, one winner. Um, so what have we got? Oh. So this one here from Knapsack, Knapsack Hammocks. Uh, this exact one is actually mine um but there's one coming in the post so expect it any day soon so that will be coming and then um brand spanking new one from husk hammocks if you do want to be in with a chance to win those two hammocks just leave a comment on this video saying yes please um i obviously want the hammocks to go to people who watch so uh, so yeah do me a favor yes please on this video and i will pick a uh, pick a winner out one week today will be the 2nd of August. So yeah, I'll do the draw on the 2nd of August. This has been an experience for me. First and last, Rob. Why is it first and last? I promised, I promised you this one. So they've both got bug nets. And I haven't. Oh, well you can have mine. I haven't got anything. Am I facing them? I'll have to. <laughs> The sit test. The sit test. The sit test. Is this uh is still wild camping if you have to bring a big trolley? Unbelievable. But yeah, one down. Two to go. Okay, so you may recall a video from a couple of months ago um, where me and cameraman Stan went out. In fact, it's the last time cameraman Stan come out. And uh, we ended up in like a, a bunk bed style, you know, one hammock on top of the other. I'll drop a bit of a clip in now. Something like this. And I know, I know the haters are going to hate, but Hang on. Anyway, so the day after that video, well, we definitely recorded it, I actually brought some of these spreader bars. And uh, 
I've never had the chance to use them because cameraman Stan's not been out since. But because his nan's out tonight, he's out as well. So, cameraman Stan and his nan are going to be in the, the two hammocks here. And it's going to just spread the two hammocks like that. I'm sure you've all seen these things before, but just in case you haven't. Right, so, what we got? Masticated. Oh, there we go. So, assuming that that goes in there. How's that? <laughs> that one seems a lot higher. Whoa. Oh, that's a lie. That's seems So that's not worked. As you can see we've got one hammock down there which is the perfect height. And then that one is uh all the way up there. What's up in there? Well, I wonder if... maybe I'll put them on the actual hammocks. Brought on the height a bit, aren't it? Better, isn't it? Still looks a bit high for me. Jesus Christ, dear, it's high. It's <laughs> alright. Is it on open? No, it's getting. Oh, that one's gone up. Yeah, Sorry. come on, Emily, your turn. And you sit in that one. Get Lady of Leisure here, look. <laughs> Not only has my mum never wild camped, she's never slept in a hammock. No, I haven't. So. You expect me to get in this and it's right up here. This is the first time you're getting in a hammock. You're going from underneath. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, yeah. I'm expecting to get in here. No, no, no. Now, You're in. You got it now. There you go. Nan, get it for like. Like there you go, now you're in. Get them feet out as well. Get them feet out. Yeah. Well, I won't get them in yet. Actually, that's all right, isn't it? I'm way above you. Wait. It's all up. Oh, my goodness, mate. <laughs> it's like a scale. Like... Does that work? Is that all right, now? Seems yeah. all right. <laughs> this is well weird. So, what I've got in, and cameraman Stan's gone from down here. To being up here. <laughs> but I'm not staying in this one. I'm going over there on my own. So who's got it right? Me mum in my big hammock. Caravan Stan in his. Both with bug nets. And then we turn around. And that's me. I could put the tarp on, but to be honest, I'm not going to bother. I have got mozzie net though for my face. Anyway, we're going to have a hot chocolate now. Right, the problem is with those separated bars that they've got on there, look that. Oh. Spread bars. <laughs> Those bars there, every time I turn over and cameraman Stan turns over, we're going to feel each other move. So I'm hoping that I get a good night's sleep because tomorrow's my birthday. I don't really need to be tired on my birthday. So we'll have to feed back on that one and let you know. <laughs> Hot chocolate time. Yeah. That's it then. So. I've got to get in. Let me just put this right. Tidy up. A little bit of rubbish in the morning. I've put the tarp up. It's due to drop down to 17 degrees Celsius, so it's gonna be gonna be still warm tonight, so yeah. You ready for the laugh? <laughs> oh dear me. I can't believe this. What is making me do? And he says. I'm not loud. 
Put my shoes in. No, you're not allowed to take your shoes in there. Well, they're not sitting there. Well, no, the bugs will go in it. <laughs> Do you fall out of these? No. You sure? Positive. What? You just poke yourself in a bit. What do you mean? Look, see how this is going out. Get this in. Oh my there you go. Grand. Grandson will do it for you. Grand Romance Dan. There you go. To the rescue. Night. How's that? Night, everybody. <laughs> Night. Right, anyway, pick you up in the morning. And I, hopefully in the morning, that means nothing's happened. No, no. Morning. Quarter past six. Slept all right. I can see some movement from the birthday tent. The tent? Birthday hammock. There she is. Happy birthday. Thank you very much. What a place to wake up for your birthday. Care to tell everyone how old you are? 50 today. 50. Um, do you want my conclusion of the... How'd you get on? Well, it's comfortable when you get there. When you get in there, it's comfortable. But, when you have to get out in the night, you can't get back in comfortable. So you're laying there all nice, comfortable in your sleeping bag, and then you get out, you come back, and you can't see where your sleeping bag's gone. And you've, then you're cold, freezing. But, cold? Well, until I got all covered up again. Oh. But that, what do you call it? That thing, that separator thing. Yeah. Oh my God, never again. All right. Because every time somebody moved, you moved. So. Crap. Oh, I would not recommend that at all. There you go, and the spread of bars are going. So the spread of bars. Nah. No good at all. Would I do it again? Would you do it again? No. <laughs> I like my comfort. You said you were comfortable. Yeah, I was, but you know, you like your comfort, don't you? Next year for a 51st birthday. <laughs> if you believe that, then. Uh... Oh. You believe anything? We're just putting Mum's hammock away. I'm not happy. Look, look. I'm not happy. <laughs> that was in my hammock. We were sleeping. It was moving, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. There you go. Oh, no. So we've come, we've packed away, we've got the brew on. Well, we've packed away, we've, we've moved the car to the top of the cliffs. So I don't know if you remember from a video the other week. Um, Basically me saying there was loads of kids and stuff making loads of noise all night. Well I didn't hear them last night, but my mum and my mum and cameraman Stan did hear them last night. So um I thought we'd come this morning on the way back, because it's, it's literally a two minute walk from the car, not even two minutes. From where you can park the car I mean. To come and show them because it's a nice view. So I'll show you guys where we were last night, but from above. So we were I'll put it on camera now, just down there. The other week when I camped, where was I the other week? I think I was more around that way. 
Unfortunately, this does attract kids because it's easy to get to. It's a nice view. And I guess it's secluded. So yeah, if you are still here, really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Um, don't forget to leave a comment saying yes, please, if you want to win the hammocks. And uh, if you want to see more from Carol, <laughs> either go to her channel, which you probably already have because there's nearly a thousand there already. <clears throat> or uh, again, let me know if she, if she should come back out for a hammock camp. And uh, well, let's bye from us. Bye. See you next week.